Since the ePortal and the standard um, and dealing with documents is uh, Adobe PDF, we're going to talk about how to redact a PDF document. PDF documents have um, uh, a bunch of abilities to be able to control the document. Simply redacting information can be um, a little tricky because people think that you can just uh, maybe grab and put a black box over it and since you're hiding what's behind it, uh, the document itself is redacted and that's not accurate. Um, basically a PDF document, imagine a, a PDF document being uh, layers of clear plastic that you're drawing on. So you have your first layer and you draw something on that first layer and then you add a clear layer on top of it and you add a second layer on top of it and you, you draw something. Well, that second layer may hide what's on the first layer, but as soon as you peel that layer off, the stuff is still there. So redacting a document with Adobe PDF is a certain procedure that you have to follow. Uh, for example, in Adobe Acrobat uh, Pro, there's the redaction tool. And what the redaction tool allows you to do is select certain areas of your PDF. You can select certain text, you can select square areas, um, and they get, they get uh, selected in your actual PDF, and you apply those redactions. And when you apply those redactions, imagine Adobe Acrobat actually getting, I'm gonna go back in the old days now a little bit, but imagine Adobe Acrobat getting an X-Acto knife and cutting out the, the paper and actually getting it and shredding it. That's what the redaction tool for Adobe Acrobat does when you're redacting a PDF. So what you wanna make sure you do is if your document has any confidential information, things that the rule doesn't provide, bank account numbers, social security numbers, what you wanna make sure is you use redaction tools to apply those redactions to your PDF and not just block over them and then put a, maybe a black fill or something like that on a different layer. Gotta make sure to do it right because it's our responsibility as lawyers to be able to redact documents and certify that we're not sending any confidential information into the public cloud, the sphere. So that's the way that you would uh, redact an Adobe PDF document.